been at sports camp today um, and he thoroughly enjoyed it but because he can't regulate his emotions arsehole mode gets flicked on and I know that's a bad thing for me to say but I can't think of a better way of describing it now I know at the moment he's, he is currently getting diagnosed with ADHD and by the looks of it he has got it we, we've known for a long time that something's not quite right so uh you'll be here uh, or you'll ask him to do something and he'll just he'll just give you the most dickish answer you could ever imagine and you've got to try your damnedest to sort of not fly off the handle and like rip him a new one you just say no no you don't speak to people like that and you you know like earlier i, I he asked for some sweets so i done him some sweets i gave them to him and he didn't he didn't say thank you so I did the usual thing. I went, oh, thanks, Dad. And um, he just looked at me and carried on. So my wife came in and said, Elliot, what'd you say? And he just looked at um, looked at his, carried on looking at his tablet. So my wife took him off him. And she said, Elliot, what do you say? And he said, I said thank you in my head. <laughs> I just don't know how to do it. I said, Elliot, I'm not a mind reader. I, You just look at me and just not say anything I just think you're being rude that's like me asking you to do something in my head like to go and brush your teeth or get ready for bed and you don't do it and then I start counting to five and then by the time I've got to the la to number five and you don't do it and I say right you're not doing this tomorrow and <laughs> and he just looked at me as if to say yeah that, that makes sense where do kids get these ideas from thinking that's a good thing to say like 